You know, you could trust this, and you're going to get a lot better by next year. This is going to be the best guitar year for you. All right, let's get started. Now, yesterday we did your very first Every Other Retrograde. Now we're going to do the same thing, but we're going to reverse the Every Other Reverse, kind of. So instead of going low, high, middle, high, high, low, middle, low, we're going to start here. We're going to go high, low, middle, low, low, high, middle, high. This is also the first time we're going to start and end on the same note in between the phrase. Watch what, what I mean. We're going to go like this. And then, now this note right there on the fifth fret, we're going to be playing that next a second time to start off the phrase again. So watch. So you have to get off that note with your middle finger and get down there with your pinky without any noise. Now I used to practice doing this. Where we would target the same note with different fingers. Same fret with different fingers. And that's kind of what this is. So we're going to go from our middle finger to our pinky. So before we even start, you might want to try that a few times. So go like this, and then your pinky comes in. Now you don't want this. You don't want a noise. You want no sound in between. So how do I do it? That's happening as a trade-off, right as you pick. Now, if you were to slow down my auto, you'd probably hear a little bit of a quick break right before. I don't know. I, I try to minimize it as much as possible, but you might. This should be the distance of a pick stroke, as crazy as that sounds. I know you could do it. All right, so let's start nice and slow here with 100 beats per minute on the metronome. One, two, ready, go. Now let's go to eights, two and three and four and... Let's do, let's try triplets. One, two, ready, go. One, two, three, one, two, three, one, two, three, one, two, three, one, two, three. One, two, three. It's so hard to count that out loud. So if you can't, I get, yeah, I, I get it. I, it's so hard. So anyway, one, two, one, two, three, go. Now, if you wanted to try that across the strings, you might want to start slower, but let's give it a shot here. One, two, ready, once per string. I know this may seem challenging at first if you've never done anything like this. So this is why you get to slow down and practice with the metronome on your own for a little bit. Take it as slow as you need. Spend as much time as you need practicing this. Nice and easy. And I'll see you